M dash, which looks like this, is a useful character but isn't something you'll find a dedicated key for on your keyboard. As a matter of fact, considering how often it is used, it's surprising how tricky it can be to type an M dash. The instructions aren't the same across platforms or even apps, so it can be tough to type an M dash when you need it. In this video, we tell you how to make an M dash in Windows. And don't forget, these tips are handy for accessing other characters like the N dash. How to type an M dash on Windows. Windows has a few ways to type an M dash. The best known method is to use what is known as an alt code. To do an alt code, all you do is hold down the alt key and type 0151 and then release the alt key. While this is the fastest method to type an M dash, not everyone wants to remember a combination of numbers to type a character. Personally, I've always found it incredibly fiddly. Fortunately, for all concerned, Windows has an emoji keyboard to make things easier. To access the emoji keyboard, press the win plus period key combination. Now that the emoji keyboard is visible, select the symbols menu at the top represented by the Omega icon. Near the bottom of the emoji keyboard, you'll see the M dash and N dash characters right next to each other. The M dash is the longer of the two. Okay, that's all there is to it. Bonus topic. When should you use an M dash instead of a hyphen or an N dash? Interesting question. We most often use the M dash to include a side statement, like this one, for example, within another statement. You'd instead turn to an N dash to connect a range of numbers like 1 to 10, while you'd use a hyphen for compound words like short term. There we are, you're up to date. If you want to find out how to type currency symbols on your Mac or insert a degree symbol, in Microsoft Word, then we have links to that in the description. Okay, as always, thank you so much for watching. That's all for now. I will see you next time.